Damn. All right, bro. It's October. Let me stop bullshitting and get to these horror games. Uh, this VHS is community. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm not reading that. Yo, bro. I, I really got to get to the horror games. Bro. It's October. All right, man. We've got to play a game called Teleform. It's, it's like 3 a.m. right now. But uh, we, we've got to play a game called Teleform. Uh, Y'all know me. If, if you, you know, sometimes I'll be forgetting I got games. Like, I don't got money like that or nothing. I just, when I do buy games, unless it's something that just came out. Like, if it's something I'm like, oh, that would be fun to play for the channel. Sometimes I'll be forgetting I got it. Like, I was really scrolling through my file, my game folder. And I seen, oh, like, what the hell is Teleform, bro? Search it up on Steam and everything. Or went to my library on Steam and looked at it. Uh, I don't remember buying it, but, but, uh. Whatever. Like I said, I be like sometimes I, I see games and I'll be like, if it's something I genuinely like been waiting on, obviously I remember. But sometimes when stuff comes out and I'm like, or not stuff when stuff comes out, but when I'm scrolling and I see stuff, I'm like, that would be fun to play for the channel. I'd be forgetting I got it. But let's go ahead and get to it, bro. Teleform. All right. I don't know too much about it, so I can't tell you much about it. But let's just jump into it. Good. I just know it's like VHS found footage from it. Okay, this is the right building. Hey, you got that camera on? Um, no, I'm about to do it now. Yeah, yeah, on now. Yeah, I got you. Yes, it's best to have as much material as possible. We can edit it all later. Okay, bet. We want the sixth floor. Can you get the button? I'm recording. You can't get the button? Lazy. Press that thing, bro. Okay. What is it? You look like you have something to say. Don't you think it's wrong to bother a widow? It was just, I was just thinking about what happened. Did you get authorization for this? Yeah, did you? Authorization? What are you talking about? Nah, I'm not about to do voices, bro. If I start getting jump straight, anybody come into that. And y'all know me, I think my voice is just trash, bro. Like, I'm not just up to God. Uh, they never approve sensationalist stories like this. You need to hand them the complete material, get it? If it's already done, it's harder for them to refuse it. It was bizarre. You didn't see it, did you? Oh, wait. Why was I able to pick stuff before and all of a sudden cameraman just got lined? They just told me how it happened. What he used to, you know. You're lucky. I wish I hadn't seen it. You heard it right. He gave Celso a VHS tape. The VT operator? Right. Celso was supposed to broadcast the tape, but he couldn't. Technical issues. Then, bam, it happened. All right. Oh, we're here. Come on. Oh, Fade to black. It would have been fire if they would have just walked with the camera. Though. That would have been hard. Okay. Uh, this game is real short, too, so it's about to be one video. That's the only thing I searched up is how long the game was. All right. Uh, okay. We're going to apartment 608. Easy to remember. What? Uh, well, I can't see what's over here, so I just see 604. So I don't know if this... Well, usually it's going that, that way, right? So... Probably be to the trash bag. Yes, sir. Look at W brain. I think that's the apartment just ahead. Here we are. Alright, Juliana, don't die now. Well, let's get ready, shall we? You can film her getting the door and all that. Oh, so that's why it's stopping, because she keeps stopping recording, maybe? I don't know. So should I knock on the door, ring the bell? What'll look better on video? Knock on the door. Uh, I wonder if she's up talking to strangers right now. I hope the camera doesn't act up during the interview. What do you mean? It malfunctions. Sometimes it blacks out for no reason. Oh, so that's what that is, maybe. I think they gave me this one because I'm new. Let's do the story then. Ferrer, for for our Ferrari, our Ferrari, our Ferrier, Ferrari, Ferrara, Ferrari, Ferrari, Ferrara. Won't be able to deny you some new equipment. Let me try again. What time is it? Uh, did you work with Walter Long? Some. Four years. This game, what did it say? It was like Walter something's telephone. I'm, this hit me hard too, you know. I want to do something for him and take advantage of the situation in the process. Sure, he'd say I'm demonstrating a sharp sense for opportunity. 
All right, bro, let's ring the door. That's a light switch, ain't it? All right, third time's the charm. Wake your ass up. What do you want? Hi, Miss Martins. We're from Channel 8. We came to give you our condolences with the camera on. Now, do you really need a video camera for that? We're making a special program about Walter. A homage, a kind of retrospective, you see. He worked at the station for so long, so we wanted to talk to you about him, about what happened. Right. Fine. Come in. It might be good to talk about it. Um, yeah, quick thinker. Real talk. You gotta be quick on your feet if you want to be the last on this job. Come on before she changes her mind. Oh, hell no. Why she stand? Okay, it lit up, but, but that dark part was, uh, that was weird. Thank you again for welcoming us, Miss Martins. Hmm. Silva here, Silva here will film our conversation, okay? Why does the like the little bottom left photo of her look so creepy, like her actual face compared to the in front? Uh, will he now? I'll have to think about that. What? Would you like to drink anything? Tea, coffee? Oh, I never refuse a cup of coffee. She better drug your ass, bro. I'll go make some. It's giving it chapter two. She pulled a fast one on you, huh? Oh, she got a dog. Forget, oh, I can move, like, slightly. Forget that, let's snoop around while we have the chance. Make sure to get anything that catches your eye on camera. We're surrounded by material here. Um, we got a dog, but that's definitely not material. Look at these here. Again, it's like 3 a.m., right? Look at these certificates. Journalism degree from UFRJS. Specialization in communication. Walter was well educated. I think Miss Martin is just the same. What a waste. Oh, he must have did something. Oh, it would be a shame if only if we only had shots on the same wall. So look around the whole room here, okay? Oh, she just got flowers on her. Oh, hell no. I don't like that, bro. I feel like I'm going I'm to turn back to one of these and she's going to jump scare me. Whoa, VCR player, fancy. How much is one of these going for now? Some two million cruzeros? What the hell is a cruzero? More than that, I think. Walter took a loan to pay for this. He told me this one time he gave me a ride. Uh, already got pyramids. Hey, that TV shot looks good. Something funny about this TV. I think there was a lightning strike nearby the other day. I might have messed it up. Actually, I'm pretty sure it happened the same day that Walter you know. Is it gonna rain today? Hardly. The rooster says otherwise. Look. Ah, these roosters never get it right. Hmm. Guess we can use this to take use this tape to set the mood. Hey, I can hear her putting water in the filter. She'll be back soon. Check out all you can now. You knew Walter better than I. He read a lot? He read most of the newspapers every day. I guess these books belong to Mrs. Martins. It looked like a VHS. I'm not gonna lie. There's a painting here, a lake. I think Miss Martins painted this. Look at this photo. Some scenery? Not a very appealing scenery. Plus, it's out of focus. This photo has a story behind it. I can feel I might ask her about it during the interview. I ain't missing nothing over here, right? Okay. Make sure I ain't missing nothing here either. Look at the dog. Oh, don't hold me later. Okay. Um. Good one. We need a nice shot of the gunpowder. Walter even carried the dog's picture in his wallet. He showed it around as if it was a photo of his son. Coffee's almost done. Oh damn! I missed the wall. Will you have one? No, I'm fine. Feel free to have one if you change your mind. I don't. I, don't, I think she's gonna like drug me, bruh. So, did you think it over? I did. Let's get this done with. Great, we'll begin shortly. Let's shoot the interview on that chair, Silva. Silva. Ah, oh, hell no, nah, bro. Ready? No, but it doesn't matter. I, I didn't get to check out one of the walls. Okay, three, two, one. We're here with Miss Adriana Martins, wife of Walter Martins, our dear colleague who left us so abruptly. 
She agreed to give us an interview during these most trying of times. The house itself really tells a story about how the two live. Uh, so am I playing both then? Because I was asking questions as the guy when the girl was talking to me, but I'm not supposed to be interviewing her, right? But these are questions. Uh, you have a rather peculiar picture in your living room. Ah, that was the first picture I took with the two of us. I put the camera on a tripod and set it up to take our picture. Then, well, this lap wing showed up and out of nowhere, I think we were too close to its nest. The bird got fierce, attacked the camera when it took the picture, then it attacked us. That was the result, a portrait neither of us appeared. From yours truly, the great photographer. He found it so funny, we had it framed. I used to find it funny too. Well, that's sad. Walter read many newspapers too, didn't he? It was a habit of his. He had the well prepared he had to be well prepared for his show. He liked to be up to speed with current events, and he complained about the younger journalists, said they weren't thorough. Yeah, I know that quite well. I noticed you have a brand new VCR. I'm just curious. I know Walter was quite the cinephile. What did he enjoy the most? Ma'am? And you ask about something else. Uh, sure, you're the boss. Okay, gunpowder. What's the best? Uh, what's been getting you through these difficult times? Gunpowder here helped me the most, more than any, or helped me more than anything. The dog? Of course, he's been quite sad. He knows something amiss. He misses Walter. At least taking care of him has taken my mind off things. Look, I'm sorry. I don't think I could keep going. Of course, Miss Martins. We have enough material already. He was so different, so nervous. I never expected him to. Did he kill himself? No one expected that, Miss Martins. I still can't even imagine Walter handling a gun. Gun? What gun? Walter never had a gun. The, the gun, the one used during the show's broadcast. He did not use a gun. I know it was horrible, but I saw it when he pulled the trigger. That's what the fur, oh my God, this dumbass name. That's what fur, I told you back at the station, right? None of these are guns, so this is kind of weird. Uh, yeah, sure. I was told to use a knife. What? How can that be? My God, I knew it. Ever since he got that damn tape. The tape he tried to broadcast? Celso examined the tape back in the studio. I think the film was burned. Something like that. That wasn't the tape. Not the original one. That was a copy. Seriously? Do you still have the original one? Yes, here. I don't know what he saw in this thing, and I don't know where he got it from. Walter made me swear never to watch it. He only watched it when I wasn't home, or in the small hours of the morning. You want to watch it, don't you, for your show? I don't think that's a good idea, but I'm too tired to try to change your mind. I, I'm going outside to have a smoke. I don't even want to hear this thing. Bro you know, was watching snuff films and uh, messed him up. This is quite the story here. Or this is it, we have quite the story here. You look like you've seen a ghost. You'll stay, right? Ah, uh, hell nah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop right there. I'm not letting you throw this opportunity away. Look, you don't have to watch it. Just just film me as I'm watching it. We'll have more takes that way. You can insert the taped content in the video during editing. Hell nah. Man, what do I look like, bro? I'm black. Um, right, let's make some room here. <laughs> All right, let's begin. Let's get my first impressions on the film. Maybe you want to move your big old head out my way, bro. Move to the side. You can fix it all in editing later. Right there, I'll press play. It's starting. What is this place? I don't recognize this building. These symbols. I I can almost do they mean anything to you? Nah, they just look like symbols, G. Me, it's the eyes. Oh, it changed. Good. So he did go inside the building. What is this place? Move your head, bro. I can't tell. What the hell you mean? What are these, bro? I can't tell. She got her big old head in the way. Uh, wait. No, no, that wouldn't make sense. Because the first one wasn't the place. I was about to say, am I picking what I'm about to see when the footage gets edited in? But that don't make sense. Uh, I don't know, bro. It looks like a school. Are those classrooms? 
Why do their clothes look so much like my high school uniform? He's just walking by everything. What sort of building is this? It's way too long. Look, there's someone up ahead. That guy, he looks, he looks. Understand a damn thing. Let me turn up the volume one more time. Yeah, I'm out, bruh. I'm about big dog. I don't think this, I don't think this profession is for me. building is the camera on let me remove the lens cover okay hurry up wait let me get the button six floor apartment 608 you look like you've seen a ghost uh yeah some deja vu right wait she got the button this time not me to the 608 already. There's the apartment. Finally. I'll do the talk. Good evening. We're from Channel 8. We came to talk to you about what happened. You don't mind if we record this, right? I, you want to talk about Walter, right? The recent events, everything's stuck in your throat, isn't it? Come in, it might be good to speak to someone. Hey, you're coming on a little strong, though. No, we need to investigate this. She's got her whole life to mourn. Damn! Come on, get in. Wait, yeah, where's the dog? Wait, I don't, that, I don't, that, in her, I didn't understand what the achievement meant, but I saw in the little picture it was the dog. We're about to begin. Will you have anything? Tea, coffee? No thanks. Well, I'll go make something anyway. Oh, no, let's just. God damn it! We'll have to wait for her. I'll, I'll have a look around here. Yeah, whatever. She's not she being weird, bro? Dog got red eyes. Bro. Hey, Gunpowder, he seems a little nervous. Uneasy? Or is he afraid? I'm weirded out too, bro. Something about this TV gives me the creeps. Oh, they said stuff different. Damn it. My fault, my fault. They, they said different stuff. I, I remember that. Pretty sure there was a pair of boots when we came in. Oh, damn. I wasn't paying attention. Hey, there's a weird thing hanging above the front door. Look. Go there and take it off. 
I didn't know if there was boots here before. Damn. What? You heard me. You could reach up there if you jump, right? So take it down. It's getting on my nerves. Yeah, bro. I'm not doing that. What's up? What's up with you? Do you always talk back like that? Just a little favor. Come on. We'll put it back up later. Yeah, I'm not about to start taking stuff down, bro. This ain't my crib. Fine. There's no idea, man. It's well taken care of. I think Miss Martins didn't let the tragedy affect her routine. Maybe it's what's keeping her functional right now. There. Let's get to the point. Walter took a tape to the studio, but it wasn't the original one, was it? The original is here, with you. How do you know that? We examined the one he had with him. I want to see the original. Well, yes, I have it here. Do you know where he found this tape? Is this why you came here? Had I known, I wouldn't have opened the door. Here, take it. I don't want to see this tape. I'll go have a smoke outside. Tell me when you're done. Hey, she's a widow. What's gotten into you? I don't have time for this. But, fine, you're right. This whole thing is making me antsy. You know what? Why don't you go check up on her? Even better, interviewer. You always wanted to do that, right? Here's your chance. See if she's up to answering some questions about the origin of this tape. Ah, there she is. What's the smell? It's not the cigarette. No, focus. If I do a good job, I might get new opportunities. I can't help Miss Martin feel a little better. Probably won't change nothing, but I still want to do it. Uh, yeah, it'll make her feel better. Maybe. Stop being rude like old girl. It's what I want to believe, at least. Miss Martins. What is it? Are you done? Not yet. Juliana's watching the tape. Meanwhile, I wanted to ask you some questions. For your program, shouldn't the girl be asking the questions? Uh, actually, I got worried about you, ma'am. I've seen many people like that girl in this line of work. Because of Walter. People who stop at nothing. Eh? Fine, let's do this interview of yours. You'd, be, you'd do better. You'd better think very carefully about these questions of yours. My head is about to burst. Uh, how are you doing? Terrible. I haven't slept since, you know. Maybe I should have seen it coming. The atmosphere at home changed ever since that tape showed up. He would watch it many times a day, locked in the room. He'd almost, he'd say he'd almost get it, but never showed me anything. He never showed it to me. Why did he make a copy? Why do we copy anything? To preserve, to share. That's what I think at least. To share. Just thinking about that girl alone in my living room watching that thing makes my skin crawl. Say, why is she so interested in that tape? Uh, I honestly don't know, bro. She off a of bean. No? Isn't that why you came here? I mean, isn't that what the story's about? I don't remember. Don't you think that colleague of yours is acting a little strange? I, I could have sworn I've seen her before. To be honest, I have a feeling I've seen you before as well. Maybe I've seen her at the studio. I'm not sure. I don't think so. I haven't been working there for long. Hmm. Maybe that's why you don't seem to like to be like her. Not yet, anyway. Me? Yes. Why are you in this, anyway? Uh, well, this is my job. I don't get to pick my task. So you choose to admit yourself, right? No, I shouldn't blame you. You're not at fault, not really. You know, I get it. I get the idea of moving up the ladder, the allure of a sensationalist piece of news. You can see it too, can't you? Nothing good came from this tape, from the whole thing. That's precisely why we need to investigate. Do we really need to? Is it really the search for the truth that's motivating this story you're working on? Or is it something else? If it is something else, it wouldn't be right. I'm not sure right is the concept we're looking for. What I do know is that you two being here, makes, is, being here is making me apprehensive. I don't want to ignore this feeling. I can't just not do my job because of how I feel. Uh, of course, you just don't learn. Look, I got a splitting headache. Go check if she's done and leave, please. I want my living room back. Thanks for your interview. Mm. 
Mrs. Martin. So, Upheld your professionalism? Damn, I was more so trying to you know, check in on her. You know? I guess I was being professional. forgot her name I, I think it's Juliana but I don't know which one I'm gonna say this how could I forget her which step makes it harder to remember that tape what I saw in it I saw the past and future that never happened in which future do I exist now? From which past did I come? The apartment. She stayed there. Better to record everything. Everything can be used. I need to go on. Is this the right way? smell here. Where did I smell this before? Smell, it's stronger here. Is this the apartment? The smell is coming from inside the apartment. Oh, I know what it is. The smell, it's ozone. everything everything can be used what is this door is this where she was the door won't budge but there's a grate Juliana tearing up like this. It's no use. That was Juliana, no? Oh my god, I saw that table and I thought it was someone like like, it's like I don't know, bro, like on a weird crawl position there, like crab walking, bro. Gunpowder? What happened here? Why is the dog here? Hey, Gunpowder, where's your owner? Am I imagining things, or is this dog avoiding the apartment? Oh, no, not now. Come on. <sighs> Gunpowder. Come back here. What's gotten in there? He just dashed down the hall. Looks like he was lying on top of some note. It's a note. I've had it, and I did what I shouldn't. I now live the past of a future that never happened. I moved through strange events, ephemeral facts. Truth and lies no more than an idiot's dream. If, any, if anyone reads this, don't leave gunpowder alone. She she also, uh, these letters are giving me vertigo. Wait, the dog, where did he go to? Yes, yes, go get him. I said, don't leave him alone. Gunpowder, I'm, I'm going inside. I need to, no, no, go, go, go. I said, don't leave him alone. Am I going inside? Really? Really? I will. <laughs> I just noticed it now, and it's awful. The smell? Just keep it to yourself. No, forget it. I'm only doing this to gather as much footage as possible. I was told that was important. Gunpowder, I'm going in. 
Go, nigga. What happened to the chair here? The thing is gone. Oh wait, the dog is there. Is that a TV? Caros telespectadores, boa noite. Hoje nós teremos uma transmissão especial do nosso programa. Possivelmente a minha última. E com ela trago um comunicado a fazer para todos vocês. Descobri algo nas últimas semanas que tem, tem me assombrado desde então. Palavras não serão bastante para descrever o que descobri. Portanto, eu vou precisar mostrar. E talvez isso venha a assombrar vocês, assim como tem me assombrado. Mas a minha profissão, o meu trabalho, foi revelar a verdade durante todos esses anos. E se quisermos nos libertar, preciso que todos saibam disso que tenham mostrado. Por isso, acho que todos sintonizem bem seus aparelhos. Não cruzem suas pernas, isso é importante. Mas fiquem confortáveis com a coluna reta. E observem com atenção. Wait, did I beat it? Did I get an ending? No, 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 it's not over. Because that's not how the game started. Oh, wait. Did I get an ending? I've never seen this menu before. When the game started, it had that screen that it just showed, but it didn't wiggle out and then turn to this. It just started up. But it's showing... It said this game was an hour and like 20 minutes main story. I'm only 32 minutes in, but I think I just got an ending. No, no, this isn't any. This, yeah, I was, I was thinking these were like chapters that we play, but no, this is just the tape that we just watched. Was it cut up because I don't have everything? I'm confused. Oh, so we we did just get an ending. Camera, the mic, they became, they can become part of us. What? Huh? I don't know why I said that. I need to catch up on my sleep. I dropped the smokes, but moved on to coffee. Let's focus on doing this well and quickly. All right. We want the sixth floor. Can you get the button? What is it, Lou? You look like you have something to say. I was just thinking about what happened. What happened? It was bizarre. You didn't see it, did you? They just told me how it happened. What do you use to, you know? You're lucky. I wish I hadn't seen it. You heard it, right? He gave Celso a VHS tape. The VT operator? Right. Celso was supposed to broadcast the tape, but he couldn't. Technical issues. Then bam, it happened. get a nice take by the window mm, you're right you have a good eye 
Someone's been coming here for a smoke. See the ashtray? Don't show me that. I haven't touched nicotine in three years. Come on, let's head down the corridor. I think it's that apartment just ahead. There we are. Well, let's get ready, shall we? You could film her getting by the door and all that. Sorry, no. I hope she doesn't act up during the interview. What do you mean? Oh, oh, the camera. Just talking about the camera. I clicked the wrong thing. I thought I said she. I was like, I've never clicked that before. Is she even home? F called her right after it happened. I doubt she left the house since yesterday. All right, third time's the charm. What do you want? Homage? Why not? We can edit it later. Right now we need that raw material. Come on before she changes her mind. Thank you again for welcoming us, Ms. Martins. That a horseshoe? Seems so. Like, for good luck? I don't know. Walter was superstitious. Oh, it would be a shame if we only had the shots of the same wall. So look around the whole room here, huh? Okay, you see, I don't, I don't see no boots here. I remember Walter bought this raincoat to cover his story. So I'm like where it rains a lot or something, right? The image got stuck in my head because he just vanished inside the thing. I remember he got cheated out of some 500... Cruzeros for an oversized coat. He looks ridiculous in it, but he paid so much for that damn coat, he just had to wear it. Poor guy. What the hell was that? Clint is begging for water. Guess it's been neglected the last one. Oh, wow. On the other one, it said that she was going crazy on it and hadn't ruined her schedule. Uh, considering all that's happened. Look, a daily trophy. Oh, right, Walter got one for an article he wrote back in the 70s. The station's owner thought this would make us stand out more, but it didn't happen. Local stations have zero chances against the big ones. I think they even had a lobby going on to hush this up. switch look at this headline the tragic passing of walter martins so it's made the news already yeah they moved fast to cover this one it happened live of course it was shocking all right sure again i guess Have one? Sure. Be my guess. So, did you think it's over? I did. Let's get this done with. Great. We'll begin shortly. <sighs> okay. Walter's raincoat. Many of Walter's things are still around here. Yes, I've been thinking about selling the apartment because of of everything. Of course, this stuff is still around here. It's been two days, they said, or a day. These, these things just make it all more difficult. I'm thinking of getting rid of everything. It's hell. What about the last 24 hours? Just look around the house. I I have been forgetting things. I would have forgotten to feed gun... I would have forgotten to feed gunpowder if he didn't remind me so often. 
and yes, what a cruel question, girl. Let us go on, yes. The event has been garnering some media attention. Did this have an impact on you? I haven't slept in a while. In the morning when I got that newspaper, there it was. The headlines starting, staring at me, chasing me. And when I locked myself in here, you two arrived. So yes, I'd say it's having quite the impact on me. Did Walter have any superstitions? He didn't seem to have one, but I was just a co-worker. We never get to completely know someone, right? No, never. He wasn't religious either. So that amulet above the front door is yours? No. Care to elaborate? No. Look, I'm sorry, I don't think I could keep going. Of course, Miss Martins, we have enough material already. He was so different. So no, so no, so no. Told me he hanged himself. What? How can that be? My God, I knew it ever since he got the. I made the right decision to bring you with me. Okay, this is how we'll do it. You film me as I watch the thing. We'll have more takes that way. We can insert the tape content in the video during the editing. <laughs> You're lacking common sense. Facts. See, my first choice was not that. Let's make some room here. All right, let's begin. Deja vu. Really, me too. Where would I have seen this before? Prison inside the cells. Are those are those people? He's just walking by everything. different today. I changed my makeup. Stop wasting time. Can you do that, huh? What's wrong with you? What? Uh, I... I think Walter's death got to me. I'm sorry. I get that, but try to calm down, okay? Sure, I'll try. Let's shoot this interview. Damn, should I have said the other one? talk to you about what happened. You don't mind if we record this, right? Are you asking about the tape? Yes. Come on, get in. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. What the hell? No, 
delicious. There's an old newspaper here. Walter kept some specific issues. There's a highlighted article. Police had closed investigation on missing persons case at a late upstate. Nothing but one videotape has been found. The family protest against the police in action. That's old news. Forget it. Certificates. Walter isn't a complete dumbass, unlike some people back at the studio, right? But I don't recognize any of these institutions. Hey, gunpowder. Why is it blurred out? Is this raincoat wet? This is Martin's list of warning yesterday. There was a storm, right? Look. There's a ripped notebook page in the pocket, some notes. I keep seeing those same numbers, so I returned here. The metal box appeared as a numeric pad, I can open it. Like metal trees, I say two radio towers, the numbers once again. Weird notes. He must have had a lot on his mind in these last few days. Hey, there's a weird thing hanging above the front door. Look, go take there and take it off. What? You heard me. You could reach up there if you jump right, so take it down. It's getting on my nerves. What the hell? My mom had one just like it at home. Looking at this thing reminds me of her and I don't want to remember her. So can you take it down? There you go. You didn't lose any fingers, did you? What a strange object. What do you, what do I do with this now? I don't care as long as it's away from me. There's a VHS collection here. They're all labeled and organized. Hmm. Uh, November 5th is missing. So we got one, two, five so far. Get to the point. She's a widow. What's gotten into? I don't have time for this. But oh, you're right. This whole thing is make. I, I already. I think I did that one on her last time. Or maybe I didn't. Damn it, I should have read that. Because then I just realized that she said maybe I should go interview her. She didn't say that on the first one. I said I should go interview her. That I was going to talk to her. And then she said, you could try it. Oh, I don't know. Just wait. What the hell? Hold on. Uh, it'll probably change nothing, but I still want to do it. I'm doing this for myself, am I not? That's smart. It was, I can't look more down. Am I not tripping or is there a horseshoe at her feet? Yeah, but she's busy with the tape. Of course, always the tape. Fine, let's do this interview of yours. You better think careful about these questions. You're going to have to How was Walter on that day? Normal, just like any other day. He spent so much time watching the same thing, but his behavior was the same. He was uneasy, but I never thought it would come down to this. I'm not sure you've seen it, but he left a note. I only noticed minutes after it had already happened. The only strange thing that day was the, that he made a copy of the tape. Why did you keep the tape? I have no idea why I kept that thing. I should have burned it, crushed it with a hammer, but I couldn't. I couldn't. I think I see him when I look at the tape, you know? Just thinking about that girl alone. Because of the poor person, yes, I could see the greed in your colleague's eyes when she asked for the tape. To be honest, I thought you'd ask questions about Walter. He was your coworker, no? That was the plan. Was it really? Don't you think that colleague of yours is acting a little strange? I, I could have sworn I saw him. first no no we can't you came here i didn't call anybody i have the right to ask my questions you know i get it i get the idea of moving up the ladder the allure of the sensation sensationalist piece of the news you can see it too can't you nothing good came from this tape from this whole thing nothing but misery i know that better than anyone and if that's the case wouldn't it be better to stop maybe it would be better well i don't want the story to be broadcast i'm telling you quite plainly drop the camera you serious the camera's too heavy you can tell them it's crazy old lady clawed at you i don't care here a little push out the window the knife 
I have the I, so I have the horseshoe. It's good luck. So it's saying the nine the good luck. I don't know, bro. a videotape. I can only read the T before the numbers. Out of one, two, and a five. I got a T. That goes a void. The tape number five is missing. Yeah, I have that already though. And this is yeah, this is the two. Same thing or what? Carcel, espectadores, boa noite. I'll read it this time. Esteem viewers, good night. Today we'll have a special broadcast in our show. If you are seeing this, I believe it is already too late. Our images have become our eyes. All we see, understand the enthusiasm to search for more to learn more. But you know what happened to me when I did the same. Why did you go down this path? Well, it doesn't matter if you've reached the truth here, it has a promise. You don't need to fully pay it, though. We don't need to subject ourselves to this. Listen, they have no control of yours. Not yet. Turn the video off. Go away. You'll sit with this in the midst of the greatest of rebellions. Go away. Do not come back. Okay, that one was different. So, uh, sorry, I hold y'all by not reading the first one. <laughs> I just should have read that one in my fault. I thought it was gonna be the same thing. Oh. Oh 
don't see nothing. Damn, I never looked out that before. Wait, I got everything. How does it? Caros telespectadores, boa noite. Hoje nós teremos uma transmissão especial do nosso programa. Possivelmente a minha última. E com ela trago um comunicado a fazer para todos vocês. Descobri algo nas últimas semanas que tem, tem me assombrado desde então. Palavras não serão o bastante para descrever o que descobri. Portanto, eu vou precisar mostrar. E talvez isso venha a assombrar vocês, assim como tem me assombrado. Mas a minha profissão, o meu trabalho, foi revelar a verdade durante todos esses anos. E se quisermos nos libertar, preciso que todos saibam disso que tenham mostrado. Por isso, acho que todos sintonizem bem seus aparelhos. Não cruzem suas pernas, isso é importante. Mas fiquem confortáveis com a coluna reta. E observem com atenção. secret code or you gotta put it in the elevator bro I, I might guess it no cap two people have been reported missing 18 has not been seen since fourth we had a chance to speak with the mother do you personally believe that there's some sinister hiding in there no of course not people love ghost stories but in the end they're just stories just stories just stories just stories just stories Caros telespectadores, boa noite. Hoje nós teremos uma transmissão especial do nosso programa. Pois. to do it all but then I just realized if I hit six I go up. that every time she talked means you were messing up. Like every time she said, no, man, we need to go to the sixth floor, man, you were messing it up. What the hell? Yes, Mr. Walter Martins, you are in possession of a VCR, correct? Yes, what do you want? I have a very special delivery for you, sir. This tape.
their floors and then like it doesn't let you, there gotta be, you know? presence here. Better keep moving. And the rewinded version looked like he was like someone was running. Whoa, here's the trench coat on. My thoughts are slippery. Before this we were going to the apartment. How many times did we go to the apartment? I need to concentrate on something. Those things, those things that weren't there before. The note was in the coach pocket. And there was one on the hallway floor. I know from Walter it said something about trees. The presence again, better move. I don't know what trees these are. Have I ever seen trees like this before? Focus. What else was there? The newspaper. Report of Walter's dead. Yeah, that he killed himself with, with what? I can't recall that. It's closer now. I'm tired, I want to sleep. Oh, no, I can't. There's something else on my mind. Yeah, it's a tape. A video tape. Miss Martin's hand is a tape. I watched the tape and then, then everything was gone. That presence. Presence. Damn, what the hell? I ain't getting no achievement around so I've embraced the forest. the hell bro i closed the game because i couldn't exit like i couldn't come back to the main menu from pressing escape like i, was, I wasn't trying to do a whole run again i was gonna let the go back into the elevator and let the forest embrace me i closed the game and i got the day one achievement i close or i didn't close it and get i closed it then opened it again i don't want to know how to get all the other ones i'm not reading them i just want to see uh they won they won they won, they won, they won. watch the warning ending then exit the game and relaunch it Oh. I don't know if this is this was a reward. Oh, that's a secret ending, and I got that. Race me real quick and see if that gets me anything. Other than that, I don't know what to do. What the heck? Thank you again for walking into the huh? So we were coming around. No, I was trying to. I actually, wait, what? The reason I closed it was so I could go back to the elevator, bro. Okay, bro, I'm not about to double back on that. I'm not gonna lie. Um, let's see, we have feature film and daily trophy. Unlock all the achievements. Okay, and so what was the last one? Play the game for 120 minutes. That's two hours. I'm not gonna lie. I might just let that thing sit there for. So there was no, there was nothing with embracing the forest then. Hey, bro, I've been playing for an hour and a half. I might open that. Oh, damn. Um. damn so i got it but i, I missed i was trying to 
show it on here. I had it like put it down here and I was waiting for them to get it. But when I went through my thing, it said I only had 91 minutes at first. I was like, 91 minutes? What the fuck? Yeah, so, yeah. But there we go. Boom. We got it. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. It was a. Uh, close. I'm tired of hearing this. I had this running the whole time I was watching my YouTube, bro. It was like 20 minutes. Um, It was a cool game. You know, cool little game. Interesting. Uh, not scary, though. I'm not going to lie. I thought it was, I really thought it was about to be scary. It was cool, though. Like, real talk, I, I, I did think it was cool, but I, I was hoping it was going to be scary. Yeah, it's uncomfortable for sure, but I don't know. It just, yeah, it's just not what I was hoping for. Free? Did I not pay for this? Huh. If for free, then that's, that's fire. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, no, it was cool, though. It was cool. You know, I, I mean, I can't, because I just 100% it, I can't really recommend it. You just saw everything it had to offer. But, uh, you know, it was, it was cool. I'm, I'm, you know, I'm interested in their, their other game. If it has a little bit more to it and if it's actually scary, like I wouldn't even put this in the horror section. It's definitely uncomfortable, but it, it doesn't give horror. It gives more just like, I don't know. It doesn't give horror, but I don't know what I would say. But it, it, in my opinion, it's not horror. Oh, they made this game? I just was seeing this game. Looks weird. But yeah, I'm kind of interested in this one. But this one seems like it would be probably scarier. But it's actually a game with enemies. So I wasn't expecting that game for me to be like running from anything or anything like that. But I just was expecting, I don't know, maybe a couple of jump scares or something. Bro. I, I didn't get scared. I just, it's hard to scare me in general. But yeah, I didn't get scared. I just was like, all right, you know. Like I was waiting for something to happen, but nothing ever happened. But uh, I like the VHS thing. Uh, go ahead and comment any more games that have that VHS thing kind of thing to it because i like it i know like a lot of the public combo games and stuff like that have it but i mean exactly more like this kind of like uh where it's it actually feels like real kind of like that one game what's that one game called uh what's that one game where you stay at the hotel it's it, that one is straight up real it's like just real people where you're in like a hotel and you got like the dude chasing you and you have to like oh man like stuff like that that's kind of what i thought this was gonna be like but uh it wasn't like looking at stuff like this. I thought it was about to be, yeah, you know, I thought it was about to be scary, but it seems like they threw all the stuff, all the scary stuff in the photos, and that was it. Uh, it was it was cool though, you know. I kind of feel like I should have played something else, but I didn't really know what else to play, and I was like, oh, I, I have this, and I, I clearly was interested in it, but yeah. But uh, what was uh, man, what's that other game? Or, uh, this right here, like I thought it was gonna be something more like this. This that Dead of Night thing. I'm not gonna lie. I would play something like this. I've never played this before. I've just seen it uh, by Jack Septagon, but he never beat it. So if y'all did want to see me play, I don't know. I might play it, but just just something like that seems like it would be fun. And that's kind of what I thought we was about to play. But yeah, it was cool. Like I, you know, I wasn't. I was good. I'm checking my. <laughs> the hell am I here? I was interested enough to, uh, what's it called, want to get all the secrets and all that type of stuff, but it just it wasn't what I thought it was going to be, you know? But, uh, yeah. All right. 